Obama family denied. Hell yeah. They walked around with a nose in the air and thought they were entitled to everything, but finally, someone denied the Obama family. This is one massive event that won't have the Obamas in attendance and it sure has people giggling. Obama spent eight years in the White House getting almost everything he wanted, but now he's learning what it's like to live life as a nearly normal citizen. He won't ever experience life as an average person again. Not with that free salary and security hovering over him like he's Eddie Murphy's golden child from the 80s. Life may not ever be entirely normal for the Obama family, and that comes with not getting an invite to every little event. Or in this case, a massive event that people look forward to. Former President Barack Obama and his wife, the former First Lady, Michelle Obama, probably thought they were high up on the list of people to invite to the upcoming royal wedding but looks less and less likely. Even better, it was practically confirmed by reports. Just because Barry and Prince Harry may have shared a few laughs, that doesn't mean the Obama family is a definite on the invitation list of the royal wedding. Esquire reported. Barack Obama and Prince Harry's friendship, it is extremely unlikely that the former President and First Lady of the United States will be invited to this year's royal wedding. Duncan Lycrum tells ToneandCowUntryMag.com. In December, CNN reported that Prince Harry told the BBC he didn't want to ruin that surprise, when asked if he would invite Obama, but Lycrum says he is almost certain that the Obamas will not be going to the wedding. The official invitations, however, have not been released. Lycrum, a British journalist and biographer of Prince Harry, The Inside Story adds that reports of the British government pleading for Prince Harry and Meghan Markle to exclude Michelle and Barack are likely true. Diplomacy is very important, he explains. Harry and Meghan will be guided by the Foreign Office's advice. The Foreign Office, which is responsible for protecting and promoting British interests worldwide, typically advises inviting foreign royals, dignitaries, and diplomats to royal weddings, Lacrum says. At Prince William and Kate Middleton's wedding in 2011, no heads of state were invited. Lacrum says he expects Harry to follow in his older brother's footsteps. Well isn't that something? The Obama family gets nixed from a major event. I thought they were everyone's favorite family. I guess that's not the case. The official invitation list hasn't been released yet, but if the reports suggest the Obamas aren't invited, then we're going along with that story. We will fully believe it once the invite list is released, but it seems like the inside reported, Duncan Lycrum, knows a little something extra that we don't. There's an excellent possibility that Lacrum was told the answer, yet told not to tell anyone yet officially. Can you imagine being invited to the royal wedding? The food would probably be fantastic. The music and entertainment would be like going to watch Disney on ice. I wouldn't care much about the nuptials. Just give me a good cocktail hour and some great entertainment and I'll be happy. Obama family would have been happy too, but if they're not invited then I guess that leaves us both out. What should Barack Obama do if his family isn't invited to watch Prince Harry and Meghan Markle tie the knot? Will he act like he was snubbed and hold a grudge? Will Michelle Obama tweet something that comes off as seething, entitled, and snotty? Esquire continues. I think part of their understanding is that Harry served as a soldier at the time when Obama was commander-in-chief, Lacrum explains. But there's a different friendship there, rather than like a business relationship. Lacrum adds that he expects Harry might reach out to Obama personally to explain, since they are friends, and that Obama won't be offended. I'm sure of all the people that would understand, it would be Barack Obama, Lacrum says. Friends? That's funny. Nothing would have stopped me from inviting my real friends to my wedding. I guess their friendship is more like the relationship you have with the town drunk. You know the guy, but you're not hanging out with him every night. Think of it like this, Barack Obama and all of us have the same chance to be invited to the royal wedding.
Although if you ask me, Prince Harry should cut her loose. Can't trust anyone who doesn't allow their husband to hunt. She might be attractive, but looks aren't everything, honey. Honey.